force have announced that they were disproportionate in their attempts to prevent a Bristol-based preacher, Dear Moodley, from criticising other religions and atheists. So to discuss this, I'm joined by barrister and legal counsel for ADF UK, Lorcan Price. Lorcan, welcome to the show. Thank you, Andrew. Can you tell us a bit about this? Because the idea that someone wouldn't be able to criticise religion or to criticise an atheist even, it sounds a bit mad. It is that, certainly, and I think the police eventually recognised that, and that's why they settled the case. But to, what happened was, essentially, they, they gave a conditional warning or a, a caution to Dia, saying that if you were going to preach, you had to get their approval and their consent beforehand. So they wanted a situation, essentially, where almost he had to run his remarks by them, and he was expressly forbidden, then, for criticising other religions and even atheism. So what, what the police are trying to do in this circumstance is very difficult to kind of really get to the bottom of, is that they're trying to, essentially, create his own in public where anything that might be upsetting to any possible person is censored or is it that they just simply don't like to hear Christian views in public?